to get back to Brianna. Imagine mm -hmm. loving your commute to work every day. Not something you're likely to hear from a lot of people no. in Boston. <laughs> but one local woman says she has found a way to turn the daily grind into daily meditation for the mind. Brianna Pitt. Brianna Pitts has the details in this week's Pit Stop. Hey guys, Chris and Inaritis. Reverend Laura Everett is a religious figure in the Boston community and an author. She just finished writing her first book on how riding a bicycle and spirituality go hand in hand. This week's Pit Stop is in Jamaica Plain. My car died. Um, you know, I was just out of seminary. Um, I didn't have a lot of money. I was in a Bible study with a bunch of women, and they said, we'll teach you how to ride a bicycle. And just like that, Reverend Laura Everett stopped driving to work. It took some time for me to stop looking at my phone or stop looking at my map um, and get a real sense of how to get around. While learning how to navigate Boston's complicated traffic jammed streets, Everett learned more about herself. I um, have learned patience <laughs> because of my bicycle. I've learned um, how to attend to other people's anger and my own anger because of my bicycle. She decided to share her experiences with other commuters, writing Holy Spokes, the search for urban spirituality on two wheels. Not too many people are talking about the meditative benefits of riding a bicycle. Like Muslims who pray five times a day or monks who get up and say their prayers, cyclists get up and ride through the city every day. And that shapes us spiritually. In Holy Spokes, Everett pays tribute to several local cyclists killed while riding, something she also does on the streets of Boston. We remember the names of those who have died while riding in Boston over the past year. And so we bless this memorial to Anita. And we bless one another too. But all who wish to say Amen. Despite the danger riders face, Everett says there is more beauty in being on your bike. We get to be outside. We get to be near our neighbors. We get to see our city in ways uh, that change us and might even change the world. And the Holy Spokes book launch party is happening Friday, April 21st at Dorchester Brewing Company from 6 to 9. Books will be available to purchase and Reverend Everett will sign each one. Chris and Anna Ritis.